Now we are at the second step of our project. In this step, we are going to configure the initialization state of our Re framework. So make sure that you are in the main workflow. And now let's double click the initialization box. You can see that the template already has these pre-configured activities. And we are going to update the init all applications workflow. You can see this workflow right after the if activity here. To see the workflow, let's click open workflow. Now the init all applications workflow is opened here. In this workflow, we will configure activities to open the browser and go to the purchase order of Optivo and get a variable for the browser, which we can use in the following activities. Before we move on, let's go to your browser and let's open the Optivo application. And you need to come to the purchase order section. Once you are ready, let's come back to the workflow. First, let's use an open browser activity. And for the URL, let's use the URL of the purchase order. And you can get the URL from here. So you can copy and paste it to the open browser URL section and make sure that you enclose the URL in a quotation mark. Next, let's use an attach browser activity. And let's indicate the browser. In the selector section, let's add wildcards before and after Optivo. And make sure that this is a wildcard, not a quotation mark. And click OK. Now we want to create an argument that stores the browser value. So let's go to the argument section. And let's create an argument named out browser. And set the direction as out and the argument type as browser. And you can get it from browse for types. And let's type in browser. We are going to use the uipath.core browser. So choose this and click OK. Once you created the argument of out browser, let's come back to the attach browser activity. And for the output of the UI browser, let's use the argument that we just created out browser to store the value of the browser. Now I want to talk about the usage of the delay activity. You may have noticed that whenever we reload a URL, it usually takes some time for the web page to be fully loaded like this. So here, we want to add a delay so that we can give time for the browser to be fully loaded. So to do that, we can add an activity named delay before the attached browser activity. Let's say we want to give it a five second delay. To do that, in the duration, we can use 00, zero colon 00, zero colon zero 05 to represent five seconds. And after we use the attach browser in the do, we can also use a delay activity. And similarly, we can use five second delay. Now we have configured the initialize all applications workflow. Let's save it. And now let's come back to the main workflow. Remember that we have created an argument named out browser in the 
init all applications workflow. Now, to deliver the value from that argument to the main workflow, we are going to establish that connection in the invoke workflow activity. First, let's create a new variable in the main workflow named browser. For the variable type, let's choose browser. And let's set the scope as general business process. Now, let's come to the invoke workflow for the init or applications. And as you can see, there is an orange sign for the import arguments. Let's click import arguments. And here, let's use the value of the variable that we just created to store the value delivered from the out browser. And let's click OK. Now, save the main workflow. Next, let's go to the project folder and go to the data. Open a config file. This file stores parameters that will be used by the automation. And here, we need to configure these parameters. First, Let's change the value of the orchestrator queue into the one that we created in our own orchestrator. If you remember, the name is purchase orders. Here, we can also change the name of the login field to make it specific to our project. So here, let's name it purchase order robotic enterprise framework. Now, save the file and close it. Now, you have completed the second step, which is configuring the initialization state.